Dr. Michael Winters here, and I'm going to show you a three-part pelvic floor exercise, which our patients are raving about in terms of results. And we're seeing results, and people are reporting results with back problems. They're able to walk farther, do more with uh, male and female specific pelvic floor issues and with bladder issues. So if you do this three part exercise regularly, it will make a huge difference for you and I'm going to show it to you now. So first I'll show you in the laying down position and then I'll show you some variations of it standing and you can do it sitting also if need be. Now, if you're laying on the floor, you're going to first have something to put between your knees. It can be something soft or something hard, but you have to have something to squeeze against, okay? So then you'll be laying on your back. You'll have something to squeeze against, and there's three parts. So the first part is a squeeze. The second part is a Kegel. We've all heard of Kegels where you pull up the pelvic floor. You want to try to pull the whole pelvic floor from the anal area to the pubic bone up and then hollow which is bringing your belly button toward your back. So three parts squeeze, kegel and hollow. Squeeze, kegel and hollow and hold them all at the same time. Probably hold it 10 seconds if you can. Later you can do longer. Let it relax. Do it again. Three parts, squeeze, kegel, hollow, hold for 10 seconds, let it re relax, and repeat that at least 10 times, and you can get a feel after a while how long you wanna hold it and how many reps you wanna do, but it's likely the more you do, the more you're going to benefit from it. So I wanna show a couple of variations in the standing position where you can bring in even more of your posture into play. So you can put something between your knees, Squeeze, kegel, hollow, bring your chin back, roll your shoulders back, and squeeze your shoulders together. So you're developing your whole core, and you're opening up your posture and improving your head forward posture, which is a problem for most people, especially in this day of computers. So again, three parts. It's a squeeze, it's a kegel, hold the pelvic floor, it's a hollow, pull your chin back, and rotate your shoulders back and squeeze your shoulder blades together. And you might find yourself losing part of it and just re-engage re everything. And that exercise can make a dynamic change in anything involving the pelvic floor and patients are reporting great, great results with it. I'm Dr. Michael Winters, Winters Wellness, Chiropractic Redefined. Be sure to watch some of our other videos on YouTube, especially those about quantum neural reset therapy, which helps the brain be healthier in relationship to things that have overwhelmed us and aren't resolved and allows our immune system and hormonal system to do better by helping the brain. So look for those videos on Dr. Michael Winters, Winters Wellness, Chiropractic Redefined.